guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you three microwavable meals. You could actually have these for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. They're so delicious. They're low fat, low calorie. Um, they're so simple to make. They require very few ingredients. I feed them to myself all the time. I feed them to my children all the time. If you have a child in college, you might consider passing these little recipes onto them. Cause like I said, so few ingredients, so easy to make and they're just delicious. So anyway, let's go ahead and jump in and let me show you what they are. Okay, so if you have watched any of my food related videos, you've probably seen me make this dish on the stove top. Um, but now that I know that I can make it, in the microwave, I always make it in the microwave. Unless of course I'm gonna be making it, you know, for a large group and we all want the same ingredients in there. So anyway, let me show you what it is. Okay, so if you're somebody who loves pizza, like I do, but you avoid it because it's very high in fat, high in calories, stuff like that, then you're gonna love this recipe. Um, it's really simple and it's my alternative to you know a regular pizza. And that's typically how I maintain my weight. I find um, if there's something that I really like, but I avoid it because of you know how fattening it is, um, I will try to create a lower fat, lower calorie version of it. And um, that's satisfying to me. Now, I'm not gonna say that it tastes exactly like a regular pizza, but it is really, really close. If my son will eat it, then it's really, really close. So anyway, it's so good. And I do also have like a keto version of a pizza um, that I also enjoy using cheese as the crust. So if you're interested in that, I will put, um, I will link the video that I prepared that in, or maybe I'll just put the ingredients and stuff and, and tell you how to make it. Anyway, um, yeah, let me show you how I make this one. Okay, so this next meal is probably my all-time favorite. I would say that last month, I probably ate it for dinner three to four days a week 
the entire month and I actually lost weight and I was not trying to lose weight. Um, anyway, they're just so delicious. They're tostadas. And um, I just had no idea that you could make corn tortillas crispy in the microwave. And um, now that I know that, it makes it so simple. My mom loves tostadas. Every time she's here, she's like, can you make tostadas? And um, I was making it, you know, a different way. Now that I know that you can just heat up the corn tortillas in the microwave and make them so crispy, it makes it so simple and they're so delicious. So let me show you how I make them. Now, I also wanted to mention that if you wanted to make your own corn tortilla chips, I've seen where um, they take the corn tortilla and then they lightly spray it with um, just a, a fat-free, you know, spray of some sort. And, you know, honestly, I don't even know how fat-free these are. The serving size says one-third spray, and that just makes no sense at all. If it says like teaspoon or tablespoon or the whole bottle, I would get it, but a third spray, what does that even mean? So anyway, lightly spray it. Um, add some salt and then it actually makes it just a little bit more crispy and um, so yeah, but I I don't ever really add the the spray at all, but anyway all I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoy this video. I'm going to go ahead and have ingredients and instructions and stuff like that in my description box, just in case you want to prepare one of these meals for yourself or for your children. And you should because they're so delicious and they're so simple. So anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you have a fantastic weekend and hopefully I will see you back here next week.